Ikea's opening day, Tiger Woods blood test, and you'll never guess who said this about the North Korean missile tensions. I'm Justin Mack, and this is The Drop. After all the planning, waiting, and figuring out where that new bookshelf you can't pronounce properly is going to sit, it's official. The Ikea in Fishers is going to open on October 11th, meaning we're less than two months away from the big debut and the long lines that are sure to come with it. Officials said the store is going to open at 9 a.m., meaning that the end of Hamilton County, as we know, it'll probably start around noon and shoppers will be dividing themselves into post-apocalyptic survivalist factions by dinner time. After all, what's more charming than a powder coated galvanized steel rack to hold all your barbed wire covered baseball bats? New reports show that Tiger Woods had five drugs in his system on the night of his May DUI. Test results showed traces of Vicodin, Dilaudid, Xanax, Ambien, and THC or as Keith Richards calls it, brunch. And finally, amid the back and forth talk of missile strikes between the United States and North Korea, policy wonks and academics say the blustering and bravado needs to stop. One observer noted, in order to defuse the tension and prevent dangerous military conflict on the Korean Peninsula, it is necessary for the U.S. to make a proper option first and show it through action. See, reasonable. And who said that? Kim Jong-un. And he said it after calling us stupid Yankees. Oh, well, nuke him. That's it for The Drop. I'm Justin Mack.